everybody, it's Kathy from the Merrimack Public Library, and this is the turtle tutorial, the tutorial, if you will. Um, so once you have your bagged craft from the teen area or curbside, I'm going to show you how to turn this into a tiny turtle friend. So you already have your turtle body prepped. It is three um, popsicle sticks that I painted green and glued together. And then you have seven pieces of yarn. Each piece of yarn is approximately two feet long. So you have about 14 feet of yarn and that might be a little bit too much depending on what you want to use, but better too much than too less. So we're going to start by knotting the yarn together and you can randomize the order or you can carefully select the order. It doesn't really matter. We just want to do it at the beginning because once you get the rhythm of twining the yarn around the turtle body, you're not going to want to stop and tie them as you go. And you want to make sure that the knots are secure enough that they are not uh, going to untie as you put a little bit of tension on them. Which is why I am tugging on the yarn as I knot it. See? A little bit of tension and it broke. So let's try this again once I trim that broken knot off. Okay, once it's all together, you're going to take one end of your very long yarn and start wrapping around the middle where all three popsicle sticks converge. And you want to leave yourself a little bit of an end here so that you can um, knot the yarn off at the end to hold it all together. So, you're going to wrap around the center until there's almost like a ball of yarn and then again holding your tail out of the way you're going to wrap around and then rotate and go to the next one wrap it all the way around. It's like one and a half times around almost. And then move to the next one. All the way around and then to the next one. And you're just going to keep doing that for the length of this whole yarn or until you run out of popsicle stick.
it goes pretty fast once you get the rhythm. I think I'm going to use this side as the top side because this side is substantially messier. So with that in mind, I tucked that last knot around a little bit more so that it's on the messy side. And then here, I'm going to tuck this tail down onto the messy side as well so I can knot it. It's a little bit easier said than done because I did wind the yarn quite tightly. Okay, I apologize for that time skip. It took a little bit more finagling than I thought to get the tail through the center. I ended up having to sort of push the yarn out of the way and then poke it through using the tip of a pen. So now I'm taking the two loose ends and just knotting them together to hold everything secure. You could trim some of these knots if you wanted, I'm not going to bother. And then I'm going to put the clean side up, grab a Sharpie and add a smiley face, which means right across from that would be the tail. And then these would be feet. So I'm gonna give him some toes and that is my little yarn turtle friend. So I think that's pretty cute. I hope this brightened up your day a little bit, was a good stress buster or just a break from whatever you've got going on. Hope you enjoyed it and we will come up with something else soon. Bye.